but I always thought they were really nasty <laughs> as a kid. Jonathan, on the other hand, I think really liked them as a kid. Five ingredients. <laughs> oh, right them. Mm -hmm. I feel like I could eat enough of these. Or I get physically sick. sick. Make yeah. yourself sick, yeah, because mm -hmm. they're so good. Mm -hmm. They're super addictive. What's up, y'all? It's me again. And today, we're gonna be making some pinwheels. I don't know if everyone knows what pinwheels are, but as far as I'm concerned, as, as I know what they are, it's those little Debbie things that kind of look like cinnamon rolls and they're like, I don't know, that big maybe and they have cinnamon in it and I think maybe they're pecan flavored I don't know but I always thought they were really nasty <laughs> as a kid Jonathan on the other hand I think really liked them as a kid but like these pinwheels that we're making today super easy super fast five ingredients so this video should be short if I keep my rambling <laughs> to a minimum so with with that being said uh if you guys wouldn't mind liking, subscribing, commenting, all the things, that'd be awesome. Really helps me out. And yeah, let's just get to making some pinwheels, okay? Okay. Okay, so the first thing we have is a pie crust. Now, this recipe, let's see if it'll focus, yeah. This, this recipe, actually, the one that I'm, I'm like getting it from, uses like two pie crusts or like one pie crust cut, in, cut into two. Like if you use my homemade pie crust recipe, um, it makes two two pie crusts, a top and a bottom, but one pie. It's confusing, but anyway, I have this one single pie crust from the grocery store that I used one of last week on my chicken pot pie video, and then I had this one left. So I'm going to use it, and we're gonna make the pinwheels. I feel like maybe I'm confusing, but hopefully it makes sense. So, if you have two pie crusts, like if you make homemade crust, cut it in half, and makes a top and a bottom. If you have two, you're going to use a whole stick of butter. But I just have this one, so I'm going to use half a stick of butter, softened, and we're going to spread it out. It's kind of like cinnamon rolls, but not. But also, it's basically cinnamon rolls with a pie crust. So, I'm just going to spread this out, and I'll be back once it's all spread out. Okay, I spread my butter out, and then in this bowl right here, I have a quarter cup of sugar, a quarter cup of brown sugar, and one teaspoon of cinnamon. Now, like I said, if you have like a top and a bottom crust, double this. But I don't. I just have this single one. This is a really good recipe to use if... <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm laughing at Calvin because he's literally like... Let me show you guys. He's right here. Come in. <laughs> anyway, um, like I was trying to say, this is a really good recipe to use if you have extra crust and you don't know what to do with it. Making this pinwheels, super easy, super fast. You don't need a lot of stuff. Um, you can put uh, nuts in it if you want. Um, I'm not a huge like nut fan. Jonathan really likes them. So maybe if I had two pie crusts, I would do one with nuts and one without. Um, but yeah, you can add essentially like whatever you think would be good to this. This is just the basic recipe for a pinwheel. So I'm basically just adding all the stuff, making a mess like we do. Make messes in the kitchen. Clean it up later. Calvin really thinks he's getting some of this. <laughs> this will be a good little treat at Thanksgiving. Maybe I'll make it when um, some of our family comes for Thanksgiving. Okay. <clears throat> so, we did that. Now, we're literally going to roll it like a cinnamon roll. Also, I preheated my oven to 350 degrees. There we go. Now we're just gonna cut it up and put it in 
our pan and bake it for like 25 minutes ish. Jonathan's in here to try these. I've already tried them. They're delicious. They're like poop. Oh, you're so That's rude. True. They do not. <laughs> no, I've had these They before. definitely don't taste like the grocery store pinwheels. No, though. these are probably way better. I guess, I think the other ones, like I said, are pecan. Yeah, but they used to be good like 10 years ago. Now they're just trash. I don't know, when was the last time you had them? <laughs> I don't know, but I'm sure they're trash like everything. And they're not as crunchy. Yeah, I like the crunch. I want some milk. We have milk. Nah. Oh, right then. Mm -hmm. I feel like I could eat enough of these or I get yourself, physically sick. Make you know? yourself sick, yeah. Because mm -hmm. they're so good. Mm -hmm. They're super addicting. Got like. You got it. They're really like. It's like caramely. Yeah, caramely like, crunch to them. Mm -hmm. They're doughy. It's that like just really nice feeling in your mouth. Wow, that's such a good description. <laughs> Everyone say they like Jonathan's mustache because it's going to leave soon and I'm sad. <laughs> I don't like it. <laughs> I'm sad. No. Anyways, uh, I think the next video is going to be, I'm, I'm going to attempt to make a turkey-shaped sourdough loaf. Ooh. <laughs> I want to see this. <laughs> yeah, maybe I should let you shape it. No. <laughs> okay. Anyways, we're going to go clean out the garden. Yeah. And, uh, this is a mess. Yeah, it's a mess. We're going to have fun. Okay. Bye. Bye. Bye.